Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you two CRM programs. First one is HubSpot CRM and the second one is Zoho CRM. So let's dive into it. We will go through some pros and cons. I'll tell you more about these two products and hopefully at the end we'll find out which one is better, at least in my opinion. So uh, HubSpot uh, CRM uh, forever free customer relationship management software that provides solution to all your CRM needs. HubSpot automates the tasks for your sales people, uh, salespeople, which allows more work with less data entry. The interactions are tracked down automatically and separate visual dashboard uh, displays deals for total visibility. Now uh, handle up to 1 million contracts, users and storage without any expiration date, all of it uh, without paying a penny. With the HubSpot CRM, you can also send emails in personalized sequence, uh, which is delivered as per the schedule you set. Get notified whenever any lead opens your email so that you know how to follow up with that particular lead. When we take a look in the software, uh, especially and in, into bundles that uh, HubSpot provides, they are making five bundles, basically. First one is uh, Marketing Hub, Sales Hub, Service Hub, CMS Hub and Operations Hub. That also translates into pricing plans as well, where you can basically, uh, when we check the pricing, when you go, uh, can go uh, by products and plan or by bundle. So let's start with the product. With free tool, as I said before, you have limited features, obviously, so it's not like a fully paid subscription, but it's a little bit, uh, little bit less featurey. Then we have marketing option, sales option, customer service option, CMS and operations. As you probably thought, with starter, with starter you are paying less, especially if you are. Uh, built annually and not monthly but you have uh, less features if you want to step it up for professional license it's 740 a month or 8880 a year now you have more options more features and obviously for enterprise reasons or uh, if you are in charge of uh, enterprise the yeah, you are paying obviously more. HubSpot is heavily relying on integrations with uh, other softwares, even Zoho, but uh, mostly Salesforce. So if you decide to uh, step into HubSpot, you have a very good chance that uh, you will need an integration with uh, Salesforce for more features. So let's uh, talk now about uh, Zoho. So CRM helps uh, businesses of all size in maintaining a high standard of customer relations uh, with its uh, feature-rich software. The multi-channel support feature lets you reach uh, your customers via any medium, be it phone, live chat, email, or though social media. With uh, visitor tracking and email analytics, you can see what your customers are seeing and find opportunities for interaction. With pre-built and customizable KPIs, you can see where your team excels and where they need more training. Zoho CRM's blueprint ensures that the same level of attention is given to the right customers. Even if, you're, uh, if, even if the sales team grows, it makes you sure that everyone in the team follows the right process. Both of these, Zoho and HubSpot, are providing very excellent support, uh, which is basically the same. They are uh, very well suited for iOS and uh, Android as well. And if we check the pricing, obviously they're offering uh, some, uh, some trial version, but standard starts with $14.00 then Professional, Enterprise and Ultimate. This price is not per, it's, uh, not per contact, but it's per user. So if you're a bigger company, you have be, you'll be struggling 
and if you are with like 10 of you so it's 140 dollars um just uh monthly or annually in this case annually you don't have the you don't have the option for monthly use so you already have uh pre-made it uh pre-made it bundles but if we check yeah sorry girl if we check uh hubspot i forgot to mention the bundles so when you are about to uh, pick one you have like something from everything in this uh, bundle types starter professional and enterprise obviously they cost the most but those features are just are are great so hubspot provides the flexibility that you maybe will be lacking in zoho in many cases not only the pricing plans but also if you need to integrate it that's where i see hubspot actually being the best obviously zoho has some uh, big names behind it and uh, both of them are very efficient so i would actually go with hubspot for sure if it uh, was a, or wasn't me but if you have any more questions please leave them uh, underneath this video if you like the video press a like and subscribe if don't you don't have to thanks for watching and see you in the next one